Hey, this is Michael, and I'm getting a cold reading on this 98 Jeep Cherokee, and the code is P0171. Okay, I'm going to tell you the things that you need to check step by step. First thing you want to do, you want to check your air filter in here. You want to make sure that it's clean, it's not clogged up, and all that. Okay? So make sure you check all that in there. It's all good. Okay? Second thing is you want to check your your, um, your fuel pump. <laughs> See that valve right here? You turn this, and there's the valve. You're going to need a fuel pump valve to check it. And then you see it's connected to your to your your injectors. You see those are your injectors right there. You want to make sure. Uh, another thing. Let's see what's the, what's the other thing you want to check. Okay, if your if your car has a if your car has a fuel filter, then of course you want to change the fuel filter. On this Jeep, the fuel filter is in, is connected to the pump inside. The fuel pump, the fuel tank. I know that because I put it. I put a brand new fuel pump in this thing, uh, like ten months ago. So after you've done all that, it's up to this. I already check everything. Ch make sure you check for a vacuum leak. Vacuum leak will cause this. So I check everything. There's no vacuum leak. So boom. Here's the problem. It has to be the oxygen sensor. Okay, I got this on Amazon. It was like I don't know, twenty something bucks. Let me show you where it's at. Ugh. I hate getting under the. You see it? You see that wire right there hanging? All right, let me lay down. Man. Ugh. Oops. All right. Here's the plug. It's loose on this one. You see the plug right there? Where's the sensor? Where's the sensor? There's the sensor right there. You see it? That's the sensor. There's the sensor. And there's the wire. So, let me see if I can uh, get this thing. Okay, we're still recording. I thought I just hit the button. Wait one second. Let, okay, just give me a second. I'm, un I'm, I'm unplugging it. I want to see something. This is right, man. This truck is so old already. Oh boy, here's the problem. Ah, uh, camera's gonna get all dirty. Oh well, I'm a mechanic. Okay, you see this in there? I just unplugged it, right? You see it? Watch. Watch, watch how it looks now. Now it looks clean. You see the oil? See how my finger is shining right now, right there? It got. Oil, look, it's full of oil. From that's transmission fluid rod right there. That thing, this thing is leaking transmission fluid. This thing is leaking oil all over the place. Look at that. Oh no, look at this. Look at the plug. Look at the plug. Look at the, all the oil on that thing. Make sure, look, get, get something, conductor cleaner, and clean yours before you start taking, you know, before you spend the money. Make sure you go on the bottom and check that plug. Look at that's oil inside the plug. Look, that one right there. You see that one right there? That is all oil. All right. Well, hey, I already gave you. Let me get off this floor. I got oil. I already... Sorry about this. It's... Well, I already showed you what you need to ch check. What happened is. The symptoms is this, when your car is, uh, when you st start it, after a little while, could be seconds, could be minutes, it starts, like ordering bad. Uh, you're going to see it's going to start wasting a lot of more gas. So, I'm going to clean that sensor out right now, and um, hopefully we don't have to put the new one on. i uh, see what the customer wants. But, um, all right, hey. Any questions, just um, leave a comment, and I'll get right back to you. All right, thanks for watching. This is Mikel. Subscribe.